Excuse me, Councilwoman Graham. I think we're, we're going to focus on the work study general, not necessarily a Mr. particular Man 68th Street. I say that because it's that project has been approved and now, and, and it, I believe the work is underway, Mr. including uh, you know repaving and so forth. So. I, 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 I don't Mayor, see any use in, in necessarily going into speculation of. It's not speculation. It, no. Um, but we have a crossway that for pedestrians that's that's underway and under contract. We okay. have these other aspects that are underway, and you're speculating whether or not it will work out or not. This that, the, these that's not relevant right now. Okay. Well, I to me this is relevant because it has a, it's germane to the 68th Street topic. And these conditions are on the grants for all the future ones we might do. The you know the general the general topic is um, you know whether or not we are able to uh, evaluate through a process and communicate to the public. Okay. Not whether or not some administrator some time from now will evaluate that cars are superior to bikes or bikes are to ADA. Well, that is not something we can speculate on. So that's why I'm saying you're, you're, you're asking some questions that are ifs, ands, or buts. I, I, These are very specific. Okay, well, I'll, I'll, I'll move know, along. I'll move could, along, Mayor. You could contribute to that discussion okay. with a separate email of some sort on, on that specific subject. Okay, let me, I'll continue uh, along, because now I'm just going to go back to criteria about danger. Um, is this a dangerous street, 68th Street? I, I think you're going again to the empirical information has already been on file and the decision was made. I, pro I promise I have a point. No, well, it's not a promise. I, I promise I'm I have a point saying here. You're, you're asking for data that we're not prepared with a file to necessarily answer or speculate about. I just, if you, if you want to do a forensic audit on this thing, it's, it's not the appropriate time for that. Well, what, with what, our, with what, I'm, what I'm getting at preparation is, of this sure. matter. What I'm getting at is, is you know, people talk about this is not a safe street or something like that. Is this the least safe street in the city, or are there streets that are less safe? Sir, you're, you're again asking a relative question that has nothing and no bearing yeah. on on uh, you know uh, on so what we are first, generally speaking. So you have to focus on that the work study, not... I want to hear that from you staff. Well, staff is I not... I want the public to hear it. Well, you're... you're you can scoff you're, at it, Tom. Hmm? I don't appreciate you scoffing at it. Excuse me. I, I'm, I, I'm just trying to make that clear just so that we can stay on topic. And the topic is the general application of it, not whether or not... Um, uh, uh, 72nd Street or 44th Street or 68th Street is more this or that relative to some other comparison okay. that no one's prepared to make. Okay, let me go, let me just back up then a little bit. Have you encountered a uh, situation where they road dieted a street and then they changed it back? Yes, I've seen uh, reports of some of those in other cities that have, that have converted back. Has a road diet in your um, um, experience ever, to your knowledge, ever violated a fire code or impaired the flow of an emergency, emergency vehicle? Yeah. Again, we, I Councilman, think we I, you know, you're asking something that may have legal liability and our uh, staffers are not prepared to testify as to the viability or circumstances on any particular case. To say that, you know, accidents happen on sidewalks or in parks or our, our, that, our that streets is yeah. generally possible, but to say, to quote and ask our staff to cite particular cases is just not part of what we're doing today. I, I say that because you're probing into an area when we're looking at the basic analysis of whether or not, whether or not technically we can rely on traffic information to make a traffic decision. Mr. Mayor, I have to respectfully disagree because I asked a question if, if staff who has researched road diets across our country, because we're doing, we may do many of them across our city, if they knew about cases where it caused an increase in collisions or fatalities. I think that's very You, you know what? I, I, I'm trying to clarify this because, again, the term road diet in many other cases where there have been failures involves a physical narrowing, a widening of 
sidewalks. It requires construction effort. It requires a lot of things that we're not in our, in, in our consideration today. So the wide yeah. term of uh, that is not appropriate. The, and I'm, I'm being very specific. You could ask that question. Thank you. Staff doesn't have to answer that question. They don't have to. They don't. Well, they, they are not prepared to answer it. That's what I'm telling you right now. But they are allowed to say, we don't, we can, we don't uh, know the answer. They, we'll they, follow up. They, you, are, you are trying to box them into a question. No, sir. They, no, yes, no, Mayor. you are because no, no, mayor. by asking them, are you prepared or do you You're know casting us? aspersions about my intent. You don't know. I, it, I am saying that the, for the record, it's not necessary, and I highly recommend that I'm we asking on professional I'm asking professional, dispassionate questions and inquiries about city staff for the, for the body public to know about it. I, I think you already heard from our police and fire saying that they are not uh, endangered and that any individual or claim coming to any municipality is not the subject of uh, of Okay. the scope of tonight's discussion. Well, so I've me, got to close with that. If you have me, other, I'll wrap it up. If you have I'll other wrap it up. topics, I'll that, wrap it up. that's up to you. But okay. certainly Thank you. end that one. I'll, I'll start to conclude here. So, um, you know, I think with the opposition's letters, we've received copious amounts of opposition letters. It does feel to me, if I can say that, like uh, we've stirred up some controversy by accepting strings attached money that benefits a small group at the expense of a large group. And I think it's, um, I think it's, um, you know, some of my colleagues have suggested that you've been misled. But I think you see what, with your own eyes and hear with your own ears what's going on. Um, they suggested that this is only a small thing, or you shouldn't worry about it, or don't, you know, don't worry, don't worry about it over here. But I think you get to decide what you worry about and what concerns you about your, your city, in the future of your city. So I don't think we should be walling off questions or topics. I think this should be open to public scrutiny. And uh, I think uh, residents deserve uh, to hear these questions and to hear the answers.